talk about some <laughs> medical issues that come up all the time. So reflux. Big problem for a lot of folks. Yep. Which, but right. if you have hoarseness, there's a pretty good chance right, it's not right, allergies, right. it's reflux. Right. So we always say, well, you know, lie in the bed and put these pillows up here, but it doesn't work. It makes sense that you would have your chest up if the pillows were here, but most people roll off the bed. So what you want to do is forget about the pillows because it doesn't work anyway. You want to get under the back of the headboard here and then put a thick book, if you're not going to read it, or, right. your, or a brick or something that's about four inches to high. elevate the bed. And you only need a little bit. You need a tiny little bit of elevation. And I get just it. remembered this. My friend Mike mentioned this. He's a, he's a rock and roll singer, and he does this to protect his voice. This is brilliant. That's, that's, that's and a, anybody can do it with a brick, right? Simple. A couple of garden bricks. It's easy. And, and they, they, all you want it under the headboard here, and a small little, the, the, the least the better. Little, li, little bit. The second big issue. Four, four inches. You four inches. This. Four inches, okay. The same thing as snoring. We get in bed with me? <laughs> uh, yeah, this so, is happening. <laughs> so you're, you're, you're lying in bed, and all of a sudden, either, either a pit bull or your husband right. or something gives, right. and, you, and all of a sudden, their snoring wakes you up. My husband is a snorer. I knew he would snore. He I does. knew it. He's a snorer, and he sleeps on his face like this, and it gets really weird. He makes <laughs> these sounds like, um, like, like the, the little dogs that have the respiratory problems. Right, suffocating. <laughs> 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 it's, it's horrible. Oh, sorry, honey, I kind of outed you. So how do you fix this? So I brought an animation of him ah! trying to sleep. All right. <laughs> so here's what snoring is all about, then we'll talk about how to deal with this. So here's someone who's lying on their side, and they roll over on their back, and they'll notice what happens. The back of the tongue begins to collapse and close off the airway. Ooh. And soon you start Yes, he's always see, on his back. Like a kazoo. See, yep. like a kazoo? With that I see. sound. All that kind of noise, and that, he's so, why he's would he do that He's always on his you? back, and I keep hitting him, and I say, roll over, roll That's over. Right. But then he sleeps on his face, and he makes the dog sound. <laughs> yeah. So uh, 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 one trick that really works well, and they're sort of related, to get you on your side, is to either put tennis balls. I think you have some over there somewhere. Tennis or maybe balls? I do. Oh, there they are. All right. You, guys don't, you know how to juggle, right? Oh, shut off. All right. So you put the, you put the tennis ball. Shut off. I love showing off. You put the te one tennis ball, not all three, one tennis ball behind your, uh, your back, tape it to your T-shirt that you sleep Shut in. Shut the door. It works. It does. It's subtle, but it reminds you not to be on your I'm back. I'm bringing the balls yeah. home, honey. <laughs> <laughs> and the other thing to do, Rachel. I'll put them on the T-shirt. Is when you sleep. This right. is how we position people for anesthesia. Right. When you lie in anesthesia, this is not comfortable. You have to put something between your legs. So put a pillow between your legs, and you'll actually be very comfortable sleeping on your side and then tilt over a little bit. And people like this can sleep all night long. If you try to sleep like this, it causes discomfort to your lower back, so you have to roll over eventually. But if you put the pillow there, it doesn't put any pressure on your right. back. We do heart surgery. It can take us eight hours. And we do it comfortably for the patient by putting that pillow there. So I learned it in surgery. That's I'm amazing. It to your home. I love yeah. this. And the last little tip is this one. Who knew going to bed with us would be this educational? Oh, so good. <laughs> So feel this a little bit if you don't mind. This is a special kind of cover for a pillow. They, these are all over the country great. now. They're one micron covers. You know that nice soft down pillow you have? Yeah. It's so, you know why it's so smushy like that? Why? Because the, 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 the little parasites, the little bugs got into the down and eat them. No, 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 and no, And that's no, no. their cocktail you're la, lying la, on. La, 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 la. <laughs> oh, awful. So when, awful. when mites, which is what they are, when mites enjoy the down, the, the pillows, they turn into a poop of mites. And oh. that causes allergies and swollen faces, wrinkles, things you don't want in your body. No fun with Dr. Right. Oz in bed. <laughs> <laughs> So buy one of these covers if you're in that condition. If you think you've got allergies when you shouldn't have them, it's often from this. They're easy to, to put on top of any pillow you have. So keep your down pillow uh, and put this cover or get rid of the down pillow or get, get a, a new down pillow and put it in this. Also do both. So this keeps the mites from developing? Yeah, it keeps, or no, keeps, the, the, they're still in there pooping. Yeah. Ew. <laughs> But they're not going to be able to get their poop to you. Exactly right. <laughs> exactly right. I get it. I get it. I'm not smarter than the doctor. 